Hello! This video walks you through the activation of Trimble's RangePoint RTX Correction Service. This video is only for this CFX750 and FM750 displays. We will reference the CFX750 display as the example, but the same steps can be used with the FM750. Please note that other videos are available for the FMX and FM1000 integrated displays. Look for them on the Trimble Positioning Services YouTube channel on www.youtube.com slash user slash Trimble RTX. Before we get started, you'll need a copy of the activation confirmation email that contains your activation password. You also must have the minimum firmware requirement of version 4.0 installed on your device. If you are not ready with these items, please pause this video and complete those steps now. Let's start the activation process, and remember, you may press the pause button at any time during this video. To begin the RangePoint RTX activation process, you must first unlock your CFX750 display. Unlocking the RangePoint RTX correction service on the CFX750 display. The display appears in Run mode. To unlock the device, select the Settings button. Now you will see the Settings screen. On this screen, select the System button to continue unlocking your device. On the System screen, select the Unlock Upgrade button. To enter your password, select the Password Upgrade button. A virtual keyboard will open, so you can enter the password that was emailed to you. The password is not case-sensitive. It also does not require hyphens, even if they appear in your password. Remember, for your convenience, you may pause this video while entering your password. After you have entered your password correctly, you will see the Password Upgrade screen with a confirmation that you successfully upgraded your password. Now select the green checkmark button. This will restart the display and take you back to the Run screen so that you can configure RangePoint RTX. If the password was entered incorrectly, you will see a screen that says your password has failed and was not valid. Select the green checkmark button to re-enter the password exactly as you see it written in your email. If it still doesn't work, please pause this video and contact your local Trimble Positioning Services customer care team or your local reseller. Complete contact information will appear at the end of this video. Configuring the RangePoint RTX service on your CFX750 display. Now that you have unlocked the RangePoint RTX service, you will need to configure your service by setting the correction source, frequency, and baud rate. From the Run screen, select the Settings button. From the Settings screen, select the GPS button. On the GPS screen, select the GPS Setup button to go to the GPS Correction Source screen. Now select RangePoint RTX and select the green arrow button to go to the RangePoint Satellite Settings screen. On the RangePoint RTX Satellite Settings screen, select the Frequency button. From here, select the Frequency field. Use the virtual keyboard to enter the frequency based on your location. You can find your frequency using this map. Pause if you need to. After you have entered the frequency, select the green checkmark button to return to the RangePoint RTX Satellite Settings screen. Select the Baud Rate button. Now you must set the Baud Rate. Select the appropriate button showing the Baud Rate for your location. You can find the Baud Rate on the same map that you found your frequency. When complete, select the green checkmark button to go to the Position Quality screen. The Position Quality screen provides options that enable you to operate when the quality of GPS position information is compromised. You must choose one of the options. Favor Accuracy provides the highest level of accuracy. This is the recommended setting. The system defaults to Favor Accuracy. Balanced Quality trades potential accuracy for a slight increase in production time. Favor Availability extends production time further with potential for reduced accuracy. Select your preferred option 
and then select the green check mark button to go back to the Run screen, where you will be able to verify that your new service is active and working properly. Verifying the RangePoint RTX Correction Service. Now we will verify that the RangePoint RTX Correction Service is configured correctly. From the Run screen, tap the Status button twice. A window will pop open to show you several settings, but the most important for you to review are the top two settings, GPS Source and GPS Status. The GPS Source should show RangePoint RTX. GPS Status should show Converged. Convergence can take up to five minutes in a clear sky environment. You are now ready to proceed with your regular operations. If you need additional assistance with your RangePoint RTX correction service, please contact your local reseller or the local Trimble Positioning Services customer care team. Please refer to the contact information that will appear next. Remember, you can pause the video at any time. We at Trimble thank you for your business.